Hey everybody, I'm pretty sure y'all can't tell exactly where I'm at because the whole background behind me is probably pitch black. Well, I'll just go ahead and let y'all know I'm down where the tunnels are, where we did our tunnel video. Hell yeah. And I wanted to do a shout out for a guy that's going to be playing in one of our new videos. I'm probably going to pronounce it freaking horrible. It's an Islamic name, so if I screw up, then just, <laughs> if you have to, correct me. Mehrab Rahman. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. I will put his name, you know, down at the, the description box, and I'll also put it on the video itself. So that way y'all can see his name. <laughs> so uh, the creepy tunnels that Mahrab was telling us about is in Valley, uh, Valley Ranch, Texas. We, we will definitely have to plan the trip ahead of time. Valley Ranch is not too far from, from where we live. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's not too far away. It's only about a, I don't know, like maybe a 30, 40 minute drive from, from where I live. Besides that, we will probably stop to get something to eat. We might do a short little clip of us at the restaurant. So we'll probably do like a little meeting, like a video meeting with Merhab and try to get to get y'all, the viewers, let y'all get to know him. And yeah, I'm walking around. <laughs> I'm walking around out here at the tunnels and it is creepy. It's fucking creepy, guys. Check it out. I mean, look. I don't know, y'all can't really see it real good because the exposure on my, on my camera, on my phone's not the best. But yeah, see, look, I'm out here at the tunnels right now, guys. It is really freaking creepy out here. Like, it's way creepier at nighttime than it is during the day. Y'all are probably disappointed uh, that we didn't do our video at nighttime when we went into the tunnels. But we may do it again later. We'll probably do like a challenge, you know. Y'all could do like a challenge or whatever for it. The tunnels are like right over there. <laughs> yeah. It's freaking creepy, guys. Where's the others? Oh, the tunnels. Yeah, they're over there. It's kind of hard to walk around out here because. There's so much stuff on the ground, I'm afraid I'm gonna trip. <laughs> yeah, I gotta find the tunnels right here. I'm like right by the tunnels. It's freaking creepy, guys. Just a second. Just a second. I gotta get real quiet. Cause I've heard people say that you could hear voices coming from the tunnels. Okay, anyway. Yeah, it's it's a lot of stuff out here. I'm trying to keep from tripping right now. <laughs> oh goodness. So, okay, I already did. I already talked about Valley View, uh, the tunnels. There's another subject that I want to talk about to you guys. Okay, me and Elmer. Well, I wasn't with them, but Elmer told me about this, and it's very very freaking creepy. Elmer, Natalie, I think Mariana, and Miriam. I think. I think, yeah, I think all four of them were all in the car together when this happened. So there was like four witnesses. They all saw it. Now, they, they weren't able to record it on their phones. So I'm sorry about that, guys. I'm really sorry about that. But they were dropping off one of Elmer's sister's friends, I believe, at her house. And just as they were leaving, they were driving down the street, and there was a street light. And the street light... They saw a kind of like a figure, like a float. Uh, I don't know. It's, it's like a, a misty, glowing type figure or whatever, just floating there, underneath the street light. Elmer drove around the corner and shined his headlights on it, and it was a freaking ghost. It was a freaking ghost. Like I was freaking out. Elmer called me. And he was telling me about it. He was freaking excited. Like he was freaking out, dude. I was freaking out because I wished I could have been there to freaking record that crap. Because I know how, how you guys really want us to catch an actual ghost on camera. And that's what we're looking for. That's what we're freaking looking for is we want to record a ghost on camera. Of course, we haven't got any luck. Just like most ghost hunters, they don't really catch their break until like five, ten years into their career. Anyway, they saw an apparition, a freaking ghost, just floating there. And as soon as Amr shined his lights on it, it started hovering, started going up into the air floating up into the air and just went wide up and right up into the sky just disappeared and they were freaking out like i could just imagine elmer's face as i know elmer <laughs> i know elmer pretty well and i know his face when he gets excited i mean he's like <laughs> his face is like freaking yeah but <laughs> that right there would have scared the hell out of me 
but at the same time i would have been excited i would have had a huge adrenaline rush my heart would have been racing i would have been screaming i'd be like oh my god we saw ring ghosts yo i've actually seen ghosts in my life okay no bullshit. i'm not lying to y'all i swear i've seen ghosts in my life i've experienced hearing really weird noises coming from my bedroom i have heard people whispering my name in my bedroom when i'm trying to sleep and these are nights where my brother's not even home. Like my brother's off staying at a friend's house or something. And I hear somebody say my name. Like literally, I'll just be laying there. And all of a sudden, this is all I hear. Cody. Cody. Like, and I keep I keep thinking, like, I'm like, Daryl, what the hell? And I turn over and I forget, Daryl's not even home. Yeah, that, that, that freaked me out. To be honest, I don't know if I've ever told you about this. But I see shadows. And I know you're probably thinking, what the hell? You know, what, everybody sees shadows. No. I'm talking about shadows like you know how you see a shadow on a wall and you see shadows on the ground and all that from light you know light shines onto an object and creates a shadow well no these shadows appear where there's no light no light anywhere they stand in mid-air like a freaking hologram like they literally will f freaking stand there in the air like a human being and I've seen at work when I work because I work outside I have actually seen a shadow of a man wearing a fedora and a trench coat and just standing like, it's just straight black like all shadow nothing no no body I mean there's a body but you like you can't see the coloration of his his jacket none of that like it's all just straight black and he's just standing there following me watching me wherever I go and some cases I just see I, like sometimes I just see him out of the corner of my eye and I turn and it disappears but this time it freaked me out like this dude was literally following me and so i i wrapped my work up fast like i got it done quick and i got on my bike and i hopped off and i got out of there quick now this time i didn't have no weapon now i don't know if this was just a homeless guy trying to scare the hell out of me and he was just in a real dark area where i just couldn't see him very good or what i don't really know but i definitely believe in demons spirits ghosts all that crap like i believe in all of it i believe in aliens all that you know all the paranormal stuff i believe in all that and i am i am pretty religious i'm not a hardcore you know religious person i'm not like you know reading the bible all the time stuff like that but sorry i keep having to flash my light onto the ground because it's freaking dark out here i can't see shit and the lights like right in my face I got my flashlight right in my face i'm trying not to trip but yeah that's that that crap scares me man that kind of crap scares me i'm sure it would scare the hell out of anybody seeing something like that but yeah guys i'm probably gonna go ahead and wrap up this vlog hope you guys enjoy this i want to do something different because most of my vlogs i do in my apartment and it's not very shady not very dark and this is supposed to be the haunting tour okay i know y'all guys want something scary so i did this crap at night <laughs> so y'all guys can see you know i'm outside right now there's a david mcdavid parking lot behind me right now and uh there's a highway back there behind me over there there's a highway so i'm out here right now i already showed y'all the tunnels I'm out here trying to make this shit creepy for you guys. Yeah. So, uh, let me see if I could do the piece. I don't know if I could do piece right now. Yeah, I can't do the piece. <laughs> there we go. Kinda. <laughs> I can't do the piece right now because I'm holding my flashlight. But you got, you guys get it. You guys get it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, peace and uh, have an awesome night, guys. And remember, aliens and ghosts are real. <laughs>